What the hell? So what's going on here? The guy spins up a bicycle wheel and hangs one end of the axle on a string hanging from the ceiling. And when he lets go of the other end, it doesn't fall but instead rotates sideways around the string. So to understand what's going on, let's look at the forces and momentums involved. So when he spins up the wheel, he introduces an angular momentum into it and due to the right hand rule, has a vector that comes out this way. And when he puts it on the string, gravity is pulling down on it, trying to rotate it like this and making a torque that due to the right hand rule has a vector in this direction. So now if we look at it from above, the vectors look like this and the resultant vector is in this direction. So now the angular momentum vector wants to move to this new position and as it does so the whole system rotates and the torque vector moves again, constantly persuading the angular momentum to follow it, causing this precession. And the larger the angular momentum vector is relative to the torque, the slower the system will process. This phenomenon is also the reason why this experiment is possible and also the reason why tops don't fall and so much more.